Andrew, a couple of runners in Australia we want to have a look at uh, Long Jack. Uh, just tell us the thinking about the, the first up run on, on the all-weather. Oh, I was more just trying to win a maiden and get some money in the bank, uh, which we did. Um, it wasn't an overly strong field, that's for sure, and not, not ideal to run on a surface you've never galloped on or raced on, but he got the job done, and um, it's a big step up now into Saturday. He looks to be a, a, a real rising talent. How's he come through that, and what do you expect him this weekend? He's come through it really well. I mean, he hasn't missed a beat since he's been in Melbourne. He's thrived, but he's going to have to, because physically he's still quite immature, and that would be the big query with him, just how, how much of a prep he's going to cop over there. But he is doing really well so far. Um, like I said, it's a decent step up in, in company, but I think he'll be competitive. Where to from this race, Andrew? Um, look, all going well, I guess there's a, there's a few different paths we can take. We just really want to see him measure up against these three-year-olds and then, yeah, no set plan, but there's a couple of options. OK, really looking forward to seeing Madison County step out in the server. Rupert Clark stakes. Uh, how is he from being our best three-year-old this year to, to forward this time around? Yeah, we're really happy with how he's coming up. I know Alicia's sort of very bullish about how he's been working the last couple of weeks. Damien Lane's been writing a lot of his work and really happy with how he's coming along. So um, he's drawn perfectly, should get a good run from there I guess just the, the weight the pull the pull and the weights that the favourites will have on him would be the slight query but uh, very happy with him. We'll see him ridden positively this weekend? I don't think he's ever a horse you can ride too positively I think from the good draw again he might be sort of three three pairs back perhaps and just getting a soft run he's fresh up we don't want to bottom him out um, doing anything stupid but I think with a soft run if they go solidly enough he'll be hitting the line hard. Where does this race lead to? Um, there's the two rack in a couple of weeks, I think that's probably the logical race and then we can sort of work things out from there. Potentially a Cox play? Hopefully, um, like you'd have to go really well on Saturday and again probably win the two rack to be considering that but he, he might be close to being a contender there.